comes with new food trends promising to be the holy grail of wellness. So how do you know if they're really worth all the fuss? Nutritionist Andrea Donsky's here to tell us and to show us. How are you, honey? talking about this because some of these um, food trends are actually really exciting and people yes. are really into them. Yep. I'm going to start with celery juice. Mm -hmm. Okay, so celery juice is the latest trend is taking over Instagram feeds. We have a bunch of celebs that are trying it. Even our own City Line stylist, Jessica Mulrooney, did it as well. So, should we try it? Because it sounds gross. <laughs> I mean, listen, if you're into celery, um, and very few people are, then it sounds like a great alternative. But why would you want to try it, and should we be drinking it? Okay, so first of all, the answer is a resounding yes. You absolutely should try we it. We should try it. it. And it's a global movement for a reason. So the person who started it is named Anthony William, okay. or the medical medium. So what he wants you to do is he wants you to drink 16 ounces of celery juice every single morning on an empty stomach. Okay. The key is that empty stomach. Now, now, celery juice has vitamins, minerals, electrolytes, digestive enzymes. It also has something called cluster salts, which help to detoxify the liver. Oh, okay. which is amazing. So the reason why we want to try it is people are there's so many testimonials for people online who are finding amazing health benefits. Yeah. Better digestion, less bloating, less acne, rosacea, less rosacea. I mean, the list goes on and on. More energy. It's amazing. So, okay. Tracy, you know me. If oh, I'm going to try it, aren't I? Well, we're going to try it, but if there is a health trend out there, I'm going to try it as well. So yeah. I've been drinking celery juice for about three and a half weeks now. Okay. I love it. You do? I do love it. I find I have more energy. I find that I'm sleeping better, and I also find my digestion is working well. But it did take a while, so it took a while to detoxify. So the yeah. first week or two, you're detoxifying, which is what it's supposed to be doing. So you okay. might get a pimple or two or some other detox symptoms, which is amazing. So I definitely highly recommend it. You want to drink it 15 to 30 minutes before a meal, and I'm going to have you try it. Now, in all honesty, it took me a few days to get used to the taste, but once I did, I look forward to it every single it's morning. It's gross, yeah, just like, <laughs> as I thought. You know what it is? It's not It's not gross. It's like celery has always been sort of like a nothing vegetable right. to me. So this is a nothing drink. Like, it tastes like celery. It's pure. It's, it's just pure. celery. Can just you celery. put anything in it? Just celery. Can just you stevia this nope. sucker? Pure celery Apple. juice. Nothing. Okay. Nope. Nothing. So the key is, like I said, you stick to it because it really does work. And it took me, even me, I'm a complete health nut, and I've yeah. tried lots of stuff that doesn't taste good. Yes. It took me a few days, but I'm telling you now, I really, my body craves it. Oh my god. It's gosh. amazing. Stick to it, stick to it, stick to it. Yeah. I will try it. I will try okay, to do good. it every day. Well, I'm gonna, I gave you some, so you're going to definitely. Yeah, I'll be texting you, you exactly. in the morning. <laughs> exactly. Let's talk about this because this looks gorgeous. Okay, so this is another trend called Blue Magic. What is so it? So Blue Magic is a powder that's extracted from spirulina. Oh. Spirulina is a blue-green algae. Now, spirulina yeah. is really great for us. It has vitamins, minerals, antioxidants. It also is a complete protein. Okay. So spirulina has two pigments. It has a green, dark green chlorophyll, which you find in most green vegetables. Yep. It also has a phycocyanin, which is a blue spirulina or blue magic. That's it's where gorgeous. it got its name from. Isn't that incredible? Yeah, it's beautiful. So I put some of the powder in this yogurt. Look okay. how amazing. So if you're scrolling through Instagram and you see all these amazing smoothie bowls that are blue, they're using phycocyanin. Okay. They're not using blue food coloring, which is why I really love it. So okay. this is blue magic added to water. So you can see how gorgeous and blue it is. Mm -hmm. This is added to a little bit of ginger and turmeric. Turmeric, so it turned it yeah. a little bit of like that bluey green. Okay, so yeah. I want to know how that tastes. So you're going to try it. Or do I want to know how well, that you know tastes? What? Why don't you Try this. This is the coconut Ooh. yogurt. It's unsweetened, so yeah. it's just—it has a little bit of a blue, blue green algae taste, but it's fine. Oh, it's okay. fine. Yeah, yeah, it's fine. It tastes like yogurt. Yeah. So okay. There you go. I mix it into my yogurt. You can put it into smoothies, smoothie bowls, whatever you want. It doesn't really affect the taste that much. No. Okay. No. I'm okay Pretty with good. that. Yeah. And it's a blue, drink, so we want to be doing it. For sure. <laughs> blue is an unappetizing color, though, for that, which is why they don't usually make a lot of food blue. So you yeah. have to get past that. It's yeah. very pretty to look at. It is so, and beautiful to take pictures with. And beautiful to take pictures with. <laughs> All right, so next we've got oat Oats. milk. Yes. Right, so oat milk is a big trend for a couple of reasons. One is because of the environment and that people are looking for alternatives for non-dairy milks. Yes. It takes one gallon of water to make to grow one pe one uh, almond. So people are looking mm. for those alternatives, right? Okay. The other reason that oat milk is really popular is because it works really well to make an amazing non-dairy latte. So baristas are loving it. It doesn't clump, it has this amazing consistency. Okay. So it really it works really well to make that non-dairy latte. There is another, there's a celebrity we saw drinking oat milk. Uh, that was Reese Witherspoon. We got a picture of her right there. So is there, other than just being a non-dairy alternative, is there anything else amazing about it? Is the flavor profile different? Well, what's amazing about, so 
not so much. I mean, it tastes fine. It has okay. a little flavor, but what's nice about it is low in fat. And it's okay. also gluten-free. So people who are following nice. a gluten-free diet, it's amazing. One thing to note, though, if you're celiac or you're gluten intolerant, you need to read the label to make sure it's for sure gluten-free yes. because oats can be contaminated with wheat. Oh, There's cross good contamination, to know. so that's an important note. Okay, good you to know. You can buy it ready-made or you can even make it yourself. Good. All right, now what do we have here? All right, so the next trend is fruit meat. Oh. All right, so... Meat made of fruit. Meat made of fruit. So what's happening is that plant-based diet continues to be a big trend in 2019. So okay. people are looking for substitutes, right? Yes. So one of the most popular fruits that people are using to substitute is called jackfruit. Oh Have yes, okay, I know so, jackfruit. So jackfruit is amazing. It's got vitamins, minerals, antioxidants, but it's also really versatile. Okay. So this is sweet jackfruit. I'm going to have you try some a little bit over there if you'd like to. Okay. Sweet jackfruit is ripe and yeah. it tastes really great as a dessert or you can have unripe or green, or it's more savory ja jackfruit. So this is what people are using to replace meat. So you can make I like it as a pulled pork sandwich. Mm -hmm. Did you try this one? This is the unsavory one. It's made with some barbecue sauce, and it's using to replace chicken, pork, and beef. Okay. Nice, right? Yeah, this is actually okay. Yeah, it tastes really good. Even texture. You might have a bit of an issue with the texture, but you can get over that. Yeah, it's pretty mm -hmm. good. Exactly. Yeah. Not bad. Yeah, I like it a lot. I'm right. shocked. Okay, cassava? Cassava. This is a big one right now. Right. Cassava is amazing. Cassava, mm -hmm. this is a yucca root, by the way, which is cassava. Uh -huh. So you can use this to replace potatoes in french fries. You can make mashed yucca root, which is really nice. Yeah. It's also So the nice thing about cassava is that it's gluten-free, it's grain-free, so it's paleo-approved, and it's nut-free. So I eat this all the time. Grain-free, nut-free. Nut -free. So if you're on a paleo diet, yeah. you can have cassava. This is cassava flour. Okay. What's nice, it's got a mild flavor and that powdery texture, and you can use it as a one-to-one -one replacement for wheat so you can make cookies you can make chips you can make tortillas yes. you can do whatever you want with it which is really awesome does it come out any more dense like would it be like using a denser flour or no, no. it's a one-to-one -one. it's, it's light exactly it's the light same. and fluffy yep. and everything like that yep. and there's a wow. cookie I'll have you try one after because it feels very carby a cassava yeah it's, but it's not gluten-free gluten okay grain -free. what is the uh, what is the trend All here right, so the last trend is ugly produce Yes. So ugly produce. <laughs> yes, you should buy the ugly produce. Right. So ugly produce, by the way, is not a new trend. It's yes. been around for food service and production for, I mean, forever, right? Right. But the reason it's becoming a trend now is because produce is expensive. It's expensive yes. to buy fruits and vegetables, yes. right? So retailers are finding other ways to bring down the price for people to be able to afford it. So this is the thing. When you go into a store, you see most produce is number one grade. It's that beautiful shape. Yes. This is number two grade. Good. All it means is that it's misshapen mm -hmm. or maybe that it's guard a little bit from the rain, but it's totally nutritious and it tastes the same. I am all about it. Yes. This is how it looks when it comes out of your garden. That's right. And it's cheaper. So right. I will take the 50% off. Thank you very much. Andrew, thank you for the trend. So good.